Frosty, we back with another video. This is going to be a 13 by 4 by 1 frontal wig from Nuo Manvia. Please, I do not know if that is actually how you pronounce their name, but that's what we're going to go with. Nuo Manvia. Again, 13 by 4 by 1 T-part wig. It is a 16-inch deep wave, and you know, I was excited sending me a 613 wig because you really get those sometimes, you know. However, in order to start, we go use our Shimmer and Light Shampoo. Make sure y'all mix this in where there are no clumps in your water. You will get purple streaks if you do not mix it in well. And as y'all see, I'm just dipping, dipping, dipping. I did get some purple streaks, but I promise I mix this in as well as I can. However, in order to get that out, just rinse your hair with some Dawn soap and it'll be back to new. We go keep dipping until it's this icy blonde. Once we got some fresh water, we are going to be using Kiss Lime Light. I did buy two bottles of this just in case I needed it and the color didn't turn out right. However, I actually only used one bottle. Make sure y'all mix your dye all the way, okay? And as I see, right when I started dipping that hair, it started turning. Oh, I was so excited. This color is giving me life. A lot of people ask for it, so here you go. Again, just making sure all the hair is saturated with the color. The color is deposited in every single strand. Y'all, this color turned out so well. And that lace did not even change. Here's the hair when it's fully dried. I did go ahead and deep condition it overnight. I'm just going to go ahead and test it out. Make sure this wig is perfect. Fits to my head. Ain't too small. Ain't too big. I'm going to use my hot comb. Thanks to my girl Asia for leaving her hot comb at my house. Because in a video that I'm not going to post, my hot comb actually blew up while I was doing my video. I still may post it. Anywho, she left her hot comb over here and this thing works miracles. As y'all know, I always use my Fab Grab Glue from Hair So Fab. I'm about to change glue because I keep using this glue like I ain't got no other glue in the world. But I promise, this glue, I mean, it works. So why change it if it ain't broken, you know? We're go going in with a thin layer. As always, make sure my wig cap is melted. We'll go in with our three heavy layers to make sure this wig will be stuck because in Texas it's hot. It's still hot, y'all. My wig is not about to fly off, and we were trying to go to Six Flags, so, you know, I had to make sure this wig was about to be stuck. I'm not about to be like some of them girls in them slingshot videos when y'all wig fly off. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Now, I ain't messed this one up like I messed up my blazing orange. This one, I laid perfectly, okay? Go ahead and wrap that hair. I let this sit for about 25 minutes. Now we're gonna go ahead and cut off this lace. Now, I do not know why I did not remember to tint this lace before I put it on my head, okay? I'm sitting here thinking about that as I'm cutting off this lace, like why in the hell did you not tint this white lace? Your scalp is not white, Asia. Your scalp is not white. Throughout the video, as I'm doing my baby hairs, you will see me try to go ahead and tint the lace. But when you got light hair, you got to tint the lace before. Oh my gosh, I'm so upset I did not. Because now all your brown is going to get onto your slime green hair. And I just wasn't feeling it. You know, I wasn't feeling it. So, we just went ahead and did the baby hairs and called it a day. Because it's going to be fixed later in the video. After we slayed our baby hairs, y'all know I'm taking my wig foundation. Now, again, I only use this foundation when I'm doing my wigs. I'm going to go ahead and place that on this part to make it look a little bit more natural. Because, again, I got a white part. Oh, 
always my go-to my aunt jackie's i use don't shrink on all my curly hair all my curly hair make sure them curls be popping use some water now always in my spray bottle is a little conditioner and some warm water i'm just gonna go ahead and saturate my hair get them curls live get all the frizz away And then just go back over with my hot comb, make sure my edges is flawless. Hmm, hmm, hmm. It's slime life. Like, now, yes, I know I'm a little late on a bandwagon because it's September, but you know, it ain't never too late to do a summer color because, you know, while everybody got their fall colors, I'm still, boom, <laughs> popping out there, you know. So, how am I liking this hair? I likes it. Now, of course, do I wish it was longer? Yes, but I'm not even mad because sometimes you just gotta do short. But you know, for the sun, for the winter, I'm going long. However, how y'all liking the slime vibe? Y'all let me know what you think, what you think. I'm digging it. A lot of people wanted me to go slime and I've been talking about it for a long time and I don't know why it just took me this, you know, this long to actually go. But you know, um, your girl's digging it now you know you just gotta find the perfect outfit because uh this hair color don't go with everything so hmm. i will go ahead and link the company that sent me this wig now this is going to be a 16 inch t part 13 by 4 by 1. okay i'm coming back to y'all because i went through the entire day and i didn't want y'all to buy this hair and say asia didn't tell you Okay, so as y'all know, I redid, you know, did my hair this morning. Cool, cool, cool. This is how it is after I left the house around 2. It is now, I think, like 9, 845, 9 o'clock. This is how the hair looks, okay? Like, again, I'm telling y'all, I don't like the ends. Yeah, so the ends look a little scraggly. And it's not as full as I want them. And it's not giving what it's supposed to give. So, I decided we're just going to cut them off. Because I can't be a bad bitch with scraggly looking ends. However, I did get a lot of compliments, you know, on my hair today. Because, you know, <laughs> bad bitch, ass fit. Um, but, yeah. So, y'all see, it almost looks like natural hair straighten too much. And it won't curve back. So I think I'm just going to cut off about this much. Give it about, you know. Again, this is a 16 inch. So I'm about to make it a 14 inch. Because, again, it's just not giving what I wish it would give. So don't tell them. Don't come back on this video and say, I didn't tell you. Because I told you. I came back and told you. Okay. Now, I feel like the hair is giving what it needs to give right now. Because, you know, this cute little curly bob can do some things, okay? So, now, I'm feeling it. I feel like the curls, you know, they plumping. You know, they ain't all scraggly at the inch now. I feel like it's, you know, giving up much bad bitch vibes, you know, okay? So, now I will say, if y'all do want to go ahead and purchase this wig, Again, I got a 16 inch. I don't know if all the wigs is like that, but I'm not mad because the curls are still popping. Okay? And I'm digging this little cute little bob, you know. So, now we're about to end the video. Again, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and be back for my next video. Bye, y'all.